Hey folks, I used to ride back here years ago and I actually had a uh, bridge built back here somewhere that was crossing over here but I can't find it because uh, the bushes are too damn high. Right on. But I did uh, venture over an area where I would not go with my uh, Kawasaki without a winch. And uh, this crawled right through it, man. So I'm going to be taking you back that way on the way home and uh, show you where I came. And uh, this area, I went over that way. And there is a little mud hole over there, but I got it through it pretty easily in uh, low gear, uh, three-wheel drive, four-wheel drive. But there used to be uh, a trail going back over here by the power lines back in there, but uh, I can't find it. Uh, this stuff is too grown up, and there's not enough people back here riding anymore, man. A lot of the people that were riding back here years ago were kids, you know. That have since uh, grown up, moved away, and uh, not many people ride back here anymore, which is a shame, man, because uh, it's really nice and quiet, peaceful ride, as you can hear, as you can see. If you listen very carefully, you can hear all the little birdies chirping. Might be a nest over there or something like that. But yeah, I took it uh took my ride down to uh Yamaha. I thought it was riding a little stiff and uh the guy that uh did the tires uh forgot to check the air. He I mean he mounted the tires but he forgot to uh balance out the air in the tires. And I thought it was riding a little rigid and a little hard on the trail, so I stopped in at uh Yamaha. As you see from uh, a couple of my shorts that I put up, and uh, talked to the guy. I asked him to check the uh, tire pressure in my uh, tires and stuff. And one had 18, one had 22, one had like 12, and the other one had like 17 or something. I forget what it was. But uh, we brought it down to uh, 8 pounds, which is good. A little soft. And uh, so I said, uh, go ahead and raise him back to 10 pounds. He, well, we started out at 12, and then I said, uh, I went for a ride and came back, and then I started out, and then I went to uh, um, 8 pounds. I said, yeah, try 8. Uh, that should that'd probably be the sweet spot. And then um, there was too much rubber on the ground, basically, and it was pulling my front end around uh, in certain uh, turns and stuff. So I said, uh, go ahead and put it to 10, and we'll leave it at 10, and that'll be the sweet spot for the uh, wheeler and stuff. So now everything's at uh, 10. Yeah. But this is what I used to do, man, back in the day when I first got to Alaska. It's just come out here and sit, man. Listen to the birds. Listen to the faraway noises, traffic and stuff. Try to get as far removed from... Uh, people as possible now i'm just back here getting some sun a little bit of breeze it's hot today man it's almost 80 degrees out actually for this area right now that's par for the course but it's still uh just a little hot for alaska but like i said i can't see where i'm pointing but you know over there during the power lines there used to be a trail that came down this way and uh there was a bridge here I don't know if somebody took it down because they were tired of people, kids coming out and uh, ripping up their uh, shit uh, from when they uh, would would exit out of the they would exit out of the woods up up here about a mile up the road, and then uh, you have to go through part of a development just to get out of there and get onto the uh, main trails again. So yeah, people probably came back here and destroyed my bridge stuff like that but uh, I'm sure if I drove up in here just a little bit and uh, looked for it we'd probably find some remnants of it but yeah who knows yeah. got a 
got some mosquitoes out here. I'm going to try to save some of my battery, and then uh, I'll show you the way I came in. And uh, the part I wouldn't go over before with my other four-wheeler, but this year we'll uh, crawl right over it, man. So, uh, we'll see you in that video, man. Right on. Love, peace, sippy grease. Enjoy the scenery, man. It's awesome out today. Right on.